Okay. Let's finish this factor. Oh, demonetized. I'm not monetized, but uh, I just uh, know that YouTube did the new rule, but uh, I just swear in the first few minutes you'll be demonetized for sure. Um, actually, what we are getting to is getting even more um, sent. It's actually funny, uh, compared to the first uh, episode, it looks like this shader is actually even more performant than the first episode where I had the other shader. It's, it looks more intensive, but seems like it's actually more optimized or something. But uh, I mean, I don't have the best frame rate. Someone uh, once commented that uh, you know I should turn down the graphics settings a little or uh, lower the rendering resolution uh, for Genshin Impact. Um, but uh, really, yeah, I don't really want to. I'm really uh, okay. Yeah, uh, I'm I'm kind of used to to not having optimized PCs. Or, uh, computers um, and I, I'm, I'm not uh, actually trained kind of to, to, to see the stuttering and it's uh, I don't know I'm um, often like in the middle of the screen where I look where, where the action is happening I don't notice it as much actually I think well, while in the recording you can look like um, on the border and stuff and you, you, you kind of notice it more and also there's kind of a little it's a little difference uh, I think between the recording and the actual game although it's very small I think I, don't know, I could try actually to um, record at a, at a better quality setting because uh, I think that's the difference, maybe, that actually the, the encoding quality or there's a loss from the encoding uh, quality because um, I when I record the, the video from my screen it is, um, I think there's also like, like stuff like capture cards like where you like intercept the, the signal to your monitor and you record it like that um, I'm not sure how, how like common this is uh, for me at least I, I don't have anything like that I, I do it on, on the same computer I game on so uh, yeah there's there's like um, while I run the game, there's another, another rather taxing process that actually uh, live encodes the recorded data or live grabs the data from uh, the screen and encodes it into into an MP4 file because uh, like storing the, the raw data would basically fill up my entire drive or all my drives in like <laughs> uh, I don't know in like half an hour or something uh, I'm not sure I'm, I'm running at the limit uh, anyway here so uh, encoded into mp4 um, it's like a, a file is like 14 gigabytes for like an hour and it kind of depends on how much is going on I think Minecraft might be a little smaller uh, for Genshin Impact in case if, the, if, there is, I mean, if there is much like change of scenery and of um, how do you say yeah I, I guess scenery and uh, action and colors and difference in the picture um, it has a lot more data to put into a picture so yeah like the file is I'd say about an hour but that's pretty conservatively about 14 gigabytes um, just like the video and um, 
Yeah, I also think just from the amount of data that this actually is, I, I record in the native screen resolution. Um, I think, I, I'm not sure if I have actually tried it, but actually dumping it raw basically would probably actually be worse um, due to just uh, like the hard disk not uh, being able to store at that rate. It, it, it's possible that uh, I could actually... Uh, I, I, I have 16 gigs of RAM, no, that's kind of okay. Um, it's, a, it's, an, um, it's an outdated... Uh, basically a workstation I got from someone for, for cheap. Um, I'm actually a programmer. Um, IT person, um, I'm generally also interested in that field, but uh, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, of it's kind of it's it's fun. It's a challenge to 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 run with not the best hardware, and uh, so I kind of I, I have the mindset of uh, working with what I have usually. But an option, obviously, uh, could be to, to, to have more RAM or, or just max out the RAM and, and actually uh, record the screen data into RAM until it is full or I stop uh, the recording, basically. And then after, and uh, basically then pull the recording data from the RAM and then encode it or something um, that might also be an option um, yeah but uh, it's it's kind of always a trade-off but uh, I, I think I am actually pretty sure uh, the recording now isn't running optimally it kind of takes a while to like break in uh, probably has to do something with the, the CPU um, being like not up to uh, speed or like it uh, it's not possible that um, after a while it will actually run at uh, one speed or FFmpeg will report speed one but it's not at speed one at, at the beginning directly um, I think the reason is, uh, yeah, realizing kind of the CPU, uh, knowing the instructions already after a while and stuff like that. Um, yeah. But uh, thanks, thanks to the second graphics card I got, um, I. I mean, I couldn't actually have this shaded stuff like I think on the first graphics card, uh, the one I or originally was. Uh, the graphics card originally in the computer was a Quadro uh, 2200K, and it's like it's a low powered card, it's like um, 68 watts or even lower uh, of power drop. And um, it's it's more like an efficient card. Um, it's not it's not the greatest or anything. And the nine seventy is obviously also not like the newest or anything like that. Um, I don't know how old it is, but uh, it's better. But uh, the efficient card is is nice for actually doing the job of uh, encoding, like uh, two MP four. Uh, the it has hardware encoding with the graphics card and uh, the second graphics card is, is good for, for that shot uh, or the original one so I now game on the new graphics card and uh, I can actually live encode uh, to, to the mp4 uh, from yeah just just from the screen and uh, it's almost uh, like I said, almost like uh, like what I see on my screen from from the recording, and it's basically live. 
um, although currently the setting is um, you have like a quality value you can adjust my quality value is kind of so like somewhere in the middle in there and I, I'm pretty sure I could actually turn it a little more down so it the quality would be a little better I think um, I think that that would actually work because also my card is not fully like uh, um, used up uh, or the performance of the card is not fully used up from the from the encoding so I think it could actually uh, do more um, I think that the bottleneck is more actually of the copying of the data um, also the RAM is also not not uh, top speed and stuff like that uh, and to the disks and um, actually uh, less with, with the graphics card or with the, the graphics encoding At least that's my theory for now, and uh, I will probably try it later uh, to, to turn down the quality and check it. Uh, for live streaming, I, I can't do it. I think uh, maybe maybe even two. Maybe I, I could try, but with live stream streaming, actual live stream, like streaming from file live in quotes to YouTube, I, I did this uh, sometimes or. A couple times I had I created like a re little radio live stream uh, where I just uh, put music into it uh, and sometimes change the music and stuff uh, until I got copyright strike kind of <laughs> uh, but the the yeah so now I don't do it and and yeah the someone commented about the performance. Um, this capturing or this recording where it isn't uh, that good is actually uh, well I say it like straight out um, I was actually live streaming from file to YouTube in the background while recording this so it's kind of a double taxing thing on, on memory copying and stuff so I think without this it would the video would also be a little better so I, I, I think I will not do this anymore I will not uh, live stream in the background while gaming while recording the gaming uh, because uh, at least for now the working theory for me is that uh, mostly copying memory around is, is, the, is the bottleneck in my, my setup um, yeah yeah, uh, uh, we, we actually wanted to create slabs. Um, we, we don't have to be uh, cheap. Yeah, almost a stack that uh, we can try. I think for now it's uh, probably working completely and then recording. I'll see you later. Oh, yeah, but. Um, well, well, yeah. Um, one problem is only for me is, is or actually the main problem is actually the the audio uh, encoding or or the audio mixing or anything with audio. Actually, <laughs> it's really funny because like um, the 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 video is actually like it's it's tons of data. I talked about the sizes of the files and stuff, and that's like the optimized thing but the the, the, the audio it, it just it is too taxing on the system or something or it, it blocks each other or something it's it's really it's it's really a, a pain to to see that kind of because like the video is well in optimal condition starting computer new it's it's nice but the, the, the audio is, is kind of fucked uh, or, or I can't do it like um, with FFmpeg you couldn't record 
like in the same process um, audio from from an audio input or from an audio output device and potentially multiple and what I would want to do is like the audio output device for for the game sound and and the uh, audio input input device for what I am saying but uh, it can't handle actually doing it it's it's too taxing on on the system uh, I think it's due to it wanting to synchronize and stuff it it can't sync it synced record mix audio uh, and video and stuff uh, in one go the, the the solution I have now or what I am doing now is actually uh, I, I do it completely unsynced. I'm, I'm separately recording each um, audio source or destination uh, from for the game sense um, and the video and it's kind of un it's not synced to each other so that's kind of a problem from for for uh, um, the quality from from the audio matching to the video, um, but uh, it's it's the best I can do so far, uh, really for recording and for, for streaming. It's it's actually much worse. But uh, what I can do, I find out in streaming, is I can um, after the fact record audio and put it in. I can't. So so basically like. <coughs> Streaming video with audio from from uh, an input. It's like not really working. It's like one frame per second or something like that. But on the other hand, um, if I start streaming from from an audio file, so I stream video live recorded and audio file then it works out somewhat okay it's not optimal it's like 16 fps or something like that but it's kind of working uh, and after the fact i can actually switch my, um, my audio source or i have a system where i can actually um, put another data stream over it through a Unix socket. So if I do that, it, it, it works. It's, it's just a problem of actually starting this at the same time and be, it's being kind of synced. Maybe it's also a bug or something, but it, it just really doesn't, doesn't work in, in the clean synced way. So let's cook some fishy. Uh, let's put some chrome. I think we have like laid the foundations for the leather and the kind of style. I think for now it's uh, okay. It's kind of time to build our domestic our house. <laughs> let's just say it like that. Domicile. Let's eat the the fishy. Actually, um, yeah. So usually, I, or, or now for recording Minecraft games, like I've actually res uh, restarted my computer. I've completely fresh um, set up. Nothing else is running. Uh, the game has all the resources it can, or it uh, it wants from the computer. There's nothing else blocking. So. It's kind of running okay, else it could probably be worse for, for example, simulating or calculating or rent, uh, loading chunks in and stuff. <coughs> yeah, but uh, as I, I think if I do the, the fresh start, it will also be uh, good for uh, Genshin Impact. I, will look, uh, I will record or the next um, 
the next uh, how do I say at the next episode uh, I will record uh, from a fresh starter computer with nothing else going on and then I will kind of check how well it goes but uh, yeah it's uh, it's just for me it's 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 more about honestly it's more about the like the technology or, or or not the actual technology not really about having the newest technology but uh, but applying it kind of kind of toying around with it it's that's more uh, my motivation for recording and uploading uh, to youtube uh, rather than like um being a huge fan of gaming, I, I like to game and stuff, but I don't even do it that often. Um, uh, the, the, the kind of um, gaming uh, itself is not the, the motivation for me to, to create this video. It's actually uh, more the techni technical side and uh, me having time, and if I play might as well record um, really because of the second GPU at least what I can say and what is like <laughs> the, the, the greatest win for me at least is, is thanks to at least thanks to the second GPU like the recording really doesn't uh, influence my, my gaming experience like the game is as good as it can look and if 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 it stutters, if it has loading issues, like I experienced this at the start, kind of with Minecraft, uh, with a couple things I had it uh, kind of first loading and lagging, and like no recording was running. I wasn't recording at all. Um, but uh, and but I can uh, basically I can start or stop recording. It it makes no difference to 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 my to the performance of 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 the game on my computer or maybe it does a little but it's basically not noticeable to me so I just really think it's really cool <laughs> um, yeah I think what I planned was to start building a house like over there I, I would really like the netherrack have it's, it's really red here it's like nice but yeah, on the other hand I know that it's actually not supposed to look that nice <laughs> uh, for the default Minecraft and I'm thinking about uh, uh, I think uh, the recipe is, is is to create the uh, redstone bricks I'm not sure why it's not showing here but then again they they too don't really look very nice on the other hand um, the ward or the nether ward blocks would be maybe something I mean uh, I can, can, can build one honestly it's it feels also kind of cheap to just put like basic well it's kind of cobblestone I mean cobblestone is okay kind of I think but uh, still it's like oh it's, it's, it's the cheap house I'm not intending to build the greatest house right now, but uh, still some luxury, some uh, processing it would kind of be a sign of uh, wealth and stuff. Still deep slide, yeah. <coughs> Nether bricks. Let's see. Ah, I don't know. It's it's really dark. But then again, actually, I think it fits to the to the to the desert quite well. Actually, I think it's this dark kind of. I mean, it's a good contrast, and it still kind of fits into the color scheme. I'd say. Like the red would be a little very strong uh, uh, for 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 the, like the house. It maybe I'd say red is maybe more for decoration. Well, it's it's up 
to whatever it's not doesn't really matter let's guess for that that's what one could think think and uh, actually I think it's I well, well okay we don't have enough iron for a hopper but uh, we can could go get some iron I guess I guess and that guess I guess correctly <laughs> um, with over here oh and also yeah we'll probably have to do the big sorting sometime soon um, do we have all the necessary stuff for mining torches coal I'd say yeah pretty much let's go for the day just some more iron although I think I have like gotten a lot of iron I'm kind of shocked I'm already out of it for, for the amount of iron I felt I was getting because it seemed to be like everywhere also like the, the stairs down here is not really optimal or the way down because it's not like there's no stairs but the, the way I get down is kind of suboptimal to me we could do better uh, and that was really suboptimal the lava is just a really bright it's almost painful I'm, I'm not sure if it's like I'm pretty sure it's due to the shader. Maybe I could tone it down a little. After a while. Oh, this is a. I think I've read about this is like the source block. Things grow on these. Basically, yeah. These crystals grow on the source blocks, so you don't want to destroy them. hurt enough sometimes so we'll continue to repeat or <laughs> repeat it but uh, yeah the caving is really nice so, yeah, that's really, really cool it's really it's it's more interesting I think than in the past I, I remember having like pop is there water oh yeah it's water having pocket edition where there weren't case at all where there were just like <laughs> areas of dirt so you, you had to basically dig the cave manually and uh, probably it wasn't actually uh, there wasn't more ore in these like fake caves but it was like the myth going around and kind of also it was at least less expensive uh, regarding to tooling uh, to dig out the dirt so the, the, the common uh, approach at least uh, from my friends and me uh, was to dig out the dirt and look and uh, basically look at the walls around the dirt for ore like you go through a cave and you look at the walls for ore but the, yeah, the uh, actual street mining would have probably been more, been more efficient. But the yeah. end. One can play out wherever one wants. And the street mining is also not that fun. It's like <laughs> but yeah, back in the days was really cool. There was 
Bluetooth based, that lets us link multiplayer. There was all this cool stuff, all this, all this multiplayer locally, you know. Um, the, actually, Mo Mojang took it away. <laughs> you, you can't play a local multiplayer on the phone anymore, I think. Or at least not, not, not in this kind of Bluetooth kind of way, where you have like, you actually join someone's, someone's world. And it, it was to this degree that actually the person was not saved at all. I mean, it's not really, it's not even like a good thing, it's just how it was back then. Uh, they eventually changed it and up the, uh, added improvement so that actually a player who'd join your world would keep his inventory saved. So in your world would be safe that player uh, whoever who joined them, who joined your world through Bluetooth, is actually in possession of this and this item. And before, in the beginning, it wasn't stored at all. So before leaving, uh, the player had to dump all his stuff into a chest, or it would just be deleted. And actually, sometimes there was there was like connection problems or or whatever. And I'm not even sure if it was due to the. the game client being buggy, or if it was like due to um, environmental circumstances like having to leave quickly because someone is angry about your gaming and stuff like that, but I just remember if, if connection basically broke you were kind of fucked. <laughs> But uh, yeah, it, it was kind of a nice experience in, in local multiplayer. It wasn't even, I think, anything with like actually being authenticated through, through a server or anything like that. We, we didn't have like internet at all. It was completely offline playing. Yeah, uh, um, like 99% sure. Like we, we, we I, I don't know, we went to some cafe with VLAN to, to, to download the game or something, but we didn't have uh, VLAN apps or anything at home, so I, I, I am very confident that, that, that the multiplayer was, was, was completely offline actually. So, uh, like, it was obviously connected locally, but it, uh, like I said, it was, I'm pretty sure it was uh, through Bluetooth. There were also games that, like Modern Warfare kind of kind of phone games mobile games that uh, were relying on a on a VLAN connection uh, we not uh, flood uh, Warsha or <laughs> we, uh, VLAN um, connection but um, someone could actually just create this connection with his f or, or could create this VLAN wireless LAN with his phone as a hotspot kind of but it didn't actually need internet so as long as there was a wireless lab to connect to uh, you could play to modern warfare like a mobile game as far as i remember and there were also kind of tabletop racing and this stuff but uh, tabletop racing was more modern i think than the stuff I was used to. But uh, yeah, it was all kind of, it was all Bluetooth based and stuff like that. And uh, now it's, now you probably need an internet connection for everything. I'm already a boomer, I, I feel it. <laughs> Back in my days, we didn't always need an internet connection. Zoomers and their internet connections. Yeah, I have uh, a constant internet connection nowadays too. Um, but uh, yeah, it kind of was more casual, and it was like a, it was really you. You were actually kind of forced to like get together with people to play. Nowadays, it's just kind of either you you just your kind of friends are like online or, or not and then you play with friends and people that's kind of more lonely i guess because of uh, many online people you don't even kind of really know or something yeah kind of depends the trend is kind of away from the 
is really a local kind of uh, connection. Uh, I, I really like this uh, update. It's really kind of uh, nice and adventure, and I, I don't feel uh, the mobs that much anymore. Like, there's not mobs everywhere spawning in just because you're in a cave. They're kind of uh, toned down compared to what I at least had in memory. Maybe I was also just uh, more of a scared kid. <laughs> or quickly scared as a kid. <laughs> Could be. I think it's nice that they kind of come to the mobs a little bit down. Or at least, uh, yeah, I think after a while, obviously, at the beginning, maybe it's uh, maybe it's interesting being like afraid of getting uh, killed by the mobs the whole time and having to really uh, be in the, uh, the secure area and securing the area. But uh, it's also nice for a change to have a different experience. And uh, well, may maybe after a while it could get boring, maybe, and uh, I'd wish for a more, uh, more, more, more tense experience. Um, I can imagine that, but uh, for now it's not like that. Until it is like that, uh, more work, more young has <laughs> time to make more updates <laughs> and also it's kind of a shame but it seems like I have forgotten or overseen not seen iron or like the how could that happen and well that seemed a bigger shame actually that's actually a bigger shame how could I not think of this because the iron ore is there or where is it there and now I don't even have a pickaxe to get it And I don't even have a pickaxe to get like out. <laughs> and no clue where I am. I mean, I know I have been here somewhere. It's lighted. But uh, yeah, other than that, iron too. I don't know this pack. It's probably this texture pack that I, I don't see the texture so well. Due to it being kind of 
dark on dark. I don't see the iron as well. I think that the, the vanilla iron is more clearly visible because it's brighter. I hear water. It might be a good sign. Yeah, we came actually from here. Yeah, now we're in the hole again, basically. And there's our way up. Well, yeah. Fuck. Fuck. The bad thing about the water being so clear is you, you can very hardly actually, or it's it's kind of it's more difficult to actually see. Um, see well where the water is and it actually like swim up the meat and so uh, just like iron but uh, I, I like the setup like this it's uh, comfy uh, I, I, I kind of want to feel special with the with the special non-default stuff with the shaders with the uh, out textures um, yeah Actually, I probably should melt some of the iron first. So, after that, having lava is really nice for melting stuff. <coughs> Where's where the iron at? Good, good. So, so, where's post? I've seriously used all, all the, the, the wood we got already. Yeah, it seems like. Huh. Oh no, it's actually here. <laughs> Obviously. Well, no, no, no. Sticks, obviously. Oh, yeah, that's great too. And then, two shovels. Resources, plenty of fish, and plenty of resources, and plenty of advertising. Not for me, but uh, well, kind of sneaky advertising, not actually sponsored. Yeah, so it turns out we did have some more iron to be needed. I didn't really notice it, but it was there all along. <coughs> so, so, so. Uh, I mean, we could start, or can't really, it's, it's kind of not that much here. But you could build more furnaces. We have one, two, three, four stacks. Well, let's. Um, let's say three. Three furnaces. And uh, let's like build it down here for like one. So right next to the lava. And then we need three buckets. And that's the Almost perfect amount for four. We can pick one out. Tick, tick. And then we can go down, down, down. Down, 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 down. Nice. And if 
we have power left, we can still uh, melt some other stuff, I assume. Let's see. Oh, yeah, we have plenty of stuff to melt. I'm not sure that's enough uh, of the netherrack though. Probably not. The chest is looking nice on the inside. Very nice. Do we or do we not build? Actually, what I was thinking, we could actually create hoppers now because we have enough iron actually. Um, so, uh, I'm not sure why. I don't really want to face that. Stone, there's actual, uh, actually a way to manufacture lava. The question is only how to get it out of the cauldron because it like drips into a cauldron. And uh, I think there's no way to like automatically get it out. I think you have to just collect it with pockets. Beca but because, well, still you could crack, put the pockets in lava buckets all into the system and then you can like with the hopper stuff you could actually deliver the lava buckets to the furnaces I'm not sure whether this actually gets pulled out from a hopper below or if this stays if this stays and blocks it's kind of shitty um, but else you could actually create a lava powered furnace manufacturer or a lava manufacturer for like furnaces and we will just uh, put in tons of we will basically create tons of lava buckets but you'd have to have a huge farm basically for all this lava but in theory you could create a thing where you collect all the lava and basically power furnaces with it and the furnaces then basically auto smelt everything coming through and kick it out below. But uh, that's the uh, future stuff. So, so, so I'm, I'm, I'm not actually good in, in building or anything, so I'm kind of used to square houses maybe later. I, I can look at, at some, some inspiring buildings or something like that and kind of still. Uh, change it it's, that's like the nice thing about minecraft you can always adjust it then again nice that yeah oh yeah we also have armor so that probably helped against the skeleton too Maybe a cactus farm over there. I mean, basically, well, I, I think we could probably do that. Eventually, an automated system with like pu pushing a block in and then letting them drop and hoping they drop in front so they can picked up be picked up by a water stream which then um, collects them into a hope or something like that because it's probably so you can't plant a cactus in a hope or stuff like that so 
we have to let it plop at the side and then from there fit into your chest. episodes in one go, one gaming session, but uh, it's, it's been a few <laughs> it's not like uh, maybe back in the olden days where I only got to game for a little bit and it was uh, like um, there was a big pause in between, there was like, it felt like it was a long time, it was also kind of a longer time, because maybe this time I came now would have been spread over a week or something, or even more. And maybe then it was like a really a long process, but now it feels like it's, oh, well, I, I just started and I'm already nearly to having maps and basically mapping out uh, the world and uh, being very well off. I mean, I already have chests with almost a stack of iron. Now I only need to build uh, the house, and uh, I even already have diamonds. Although not from the mine, just from uh, from uh, from the uh, from the pyramid <laughs> to where I spawned. Just luck, basically. But yeah, still. Uh, like getting diamonds was the, the old time the old school was like you almost beat the game before before actually the end and stuff appeared this uh, getting diamonds was the big thing uh, I mean there was in the early days it was difficult to find iron but I didn't really play them already but I think once not they came where uh, I mean diamonds where, where diamonds were a little better or a little more widespread in the underground and they're like better to find or you could get more uh, you could get faster diamonds basically and still diamonds were the big thing and nowadays it's not not that much it's like uh, I feel like it's getting easier ways I mean diamonds are still valuable I guess for, for the armor and stuff but the armor is still costly but just feels like that you know, the bed is much more valuable than all the diamonds in the world.
is useful for actually yeah, I think it's just for green and for composting but that doesn't really give you very much except burning some yeah, I think I think the cactus isn't even that really useful except for like a mod farm uh, yeah. It's almost kind of defeating the purpose, but then again, it's kind of not. But uh, you know, I, I, at least I, I used to have that like, chicken farm, um, but it was never really up to big stuff. And the chicken and the wheat, and then you just eliminate basically the need for food. I'm probably going to do some farms too eventually, or, or the need for iron, but. I think this was also too powerful. Um, although my 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 zombie for the iron golem farm used to despawn, so it wasn't actually that powerful eventually. But when it run ran, it got like tons of iron in like no time, and it was almost like cheating kind of because it kind of was. Uh, I'd say. It's, it was just uh, too powerful to be like possibly intended to be handled like that. reflection does still actually scare me. There's always this thing like oh so there are some of them, but then it can't then <laughs> or but then it turns out there isn't actually any more there. And it's just like the reflection of oneself or any or like other movement and it just kinda looks like the remote. And then there is no then when it's uh I just want to say demotivated um pissed off no 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 pissed off like um um uh, I don't know the word doesn't come to mind And then you feel bad. Oh no, no monsters are actually here. I am am I even too ugly for the monsters? No, can't be. I want to 
when it came is. Uh, digging up is actually very dangerous, remember that kids. Uh -uh. But there's also some some to be heard. But then again, some is meant to be far away. It's just really scary to be heard. And we still have we have no cold, so there's no light source for us. And don't step into the lava. But be good by the lava. idea to stand around too much here and it's also still again it's it's not a good idea to pick up so upwards but and it's also not a good idea to block your exit path So where the fuck did that came from? It's also not a good idea to not remember where it came from. And down actually? Maybe? No. Probably up. Uh oh, don't look at it. It's black, it's tall, and it doesn't like to look black, be looked at. It's aggressive. Maybe it has a knife, and maybe it even has a clock, who knows. can finally do something against their orientation problems. And whoa, that's a ton of redstone. Oh, no. How could I possibly use all of this? think about actually getting rid of our uh, XP points to our actual users instead of like, immediately losing it again for dying. <coughs> so where were the iron at? Yeah, nah, let's create this, the, the power tool. Now to go. Where do I go? Uh, 
What is the shit point? I thought this points towards uh, your spawn, or does it point towards world spawn? Did I spawn back there? I mean, it should have been very close. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Up, run, run, run. Is it this block? No. No, it's your fucking... Oh, why doesn't it load? I mean, it's not like my game is lagging or anything. It's just a shade. And it's pretty sure it's just... Yeah, it's just sand too. Okay, that's, that's kind of a weird kind of one now. But it uh, looks like spawn is here. So, yeah, it's not a big deal to get back home. You already can see it. But uh, we could like integrate it. I think, um, I'm not sure what about, uh, what what's going on if there are uh, like walls up there but we could actually create a, a nice platform to respawn and then safely traverse or something like that or be at home already and stuff like that exploring but then uh, I think we first try to build <laughs> but we need much 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 more and what tools are more iron and more everything um I can do I need to take this yeah. okay till another day 